Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have a video for you guys. Um, right now I'm here to show you guys my first three 2016 Monster Jam trucks and my first, and then I have another one. It'll be so it'll be my first four trucks that I've gotten in 2016. But first, we'll start with the three. My first three that come with the new stunt ramp. So. I have one in the, I have the three here, the one in the middle I'll show you guys, but, um, it has, so this case, it's case A, has crustacean, the blue one, um, son of a jigger, it's a new one for this year, it has, uh, colored tires, um, higher education, mud treads, um, right there is El Toro Local X-Ray, it's actually orange, um, we have a grave digger over here, Avenger, Dragon, and Monster Mutt. On the very end, on the corner. So those are the eight in this case. I heard some. Uh, I've heard from on Instagram. A couple people I follow have been finding everything. They found all seven, but crustacean. I've heard that crustacean hasn't been released yet. So, <clears throat> um, maybe that's why I didn't find it today. But I did find some of them. Well, I found there was only the crustacean and some of the digger I wanted from this case. But when I went to Target, they had a 3 for 10, de uh, 10 sale, so I just got 3 of them, because I liked the other 2, but, so, I got, I, it was possible for me to get all 7 of the ones that have been released. So, the f first one, we'll start with on this side, so, uh, any, any of those ones, or any of the top ones, any 8 of them, was one that I would get. This first one is Monster Mutt. That's right. I got a Monster Mutt because I don't believe I have a new Monster Mutt. I think the last Monster Mutt I got was still had the old style with the ears that they had to put in at the factory. Not the molded ears into the body. So I decided to get a new Monster Mutt. And it comes with the bull ramp. It's... I'll show you the guys the ramp in a minute after I open them. Yeah, the second, oh, the second one I'll do this side now. This one is any of the last six we have left because, um, yeah, because, like I said, I've heard Crustacean hasn't been released, so. Okay, the next one. Yep, that's right. I got El Toro Loco X-Ray. As you guys can see, it's actually orange. Pretty nice. I think it's cool that they finally got got it right and made an orange one, but I think it's just because it's X-ray. I think if this, if they made a body and put this paint on, I think it'd still be red. I think it's just the, the it's orange because it's a plastic body. But it'd be nice if they finally make an uh, orange metal body one. And last but not least, yes, this one's open. Yeah, there you go. There's a full wheel. Um. That's right, son of a digger with the color tires. Um, I already opened this one. I just wanted to check it out and stuff. I couldn't wait until I could get this video done, so I just wanted to check it out quick. But I just put it back in there after it was done so I can show it here. But alright, this will be the first one I open. And there's the truck. <clears throat> and then there's the ramp. And it's just the regular old thing. I do gotta say I don't really like that they're putting the tape on the cards either. Like on the cards and the blisters to hold them on. But it makes it really hard to get it open. But oh well I guess if it keeps it from trucks opening because one time I went to Walmart there was like 10 trucks on the shelf because they were open and they just stuck price stickers on it. But so I just I guess it's nice that they're doing it, but I don't like it because it makes it really hard to open them. But alright, so yeah, this is the first one. So I'm doing it's cool. It has black rims, and then it has the blue tires. It's kind of... It's like the same hardness tires on the regular trucks. I mean, yeah, it's like pyramid. I'd have to say it's the same hardness. But it just makes it look cool. Um, Having the colored tires... It just kind of brings out the Son of a Digger feel that it gives it. But, so I think it's pretty cool. It comes with the ramp. It has a Monster Jam logo right there. Hot Wheels logo. Let's see if I can get it in. 
right there, kind of, there you go, you can kind of see it, Hot Wheels logo right there, it's, on camera, it don't look very bright, but it's a very bright orange ramp, but yeah, it's pretty cool, it's, uh, it's made out of wood, it's like a wood kind of ramp, so yeah, that's the first one, next one is Monster Mart, there we go, oh, it's hard to open, Alright, here's the jump it comes with. It's kind of a light blue, it's lighter than Son of a Digger's tires for sure. That's the jump, and then there's Monster Mutt. It has some white on the tire. I think it's just from the tire getting stuck to the cardboard. Yeah, so here's Monster Mutt. I think this is, yeah, I think, I'm pretty sure this is my first new one. That's yeah, cool, it has like 3D ears and then the bumps on the collar is. Can't really get in. There, there we go. Like the gray bumps there, and the collar is actually 3D. Then this one comes with a blue ramp. It's kind of like a metal. I would guess. I'm thinking it's. I think it's a metal ramp. Right. Right. Let's see. I'll bring it up closer. Right there is a Monster Jam logo. This sign has a Hot Wheels logo. And yeah, I would, I'm think. I think this is a metal ramp. That's what. Monster Mutt came with. Monster Mutt's not going to stay. And last but not least, El Toro Local. There's the ramp, which is a very, very bright green ramp. And real quick, before I forget, I want to show you guys. Um, I was watching Race, Race Groove's video. Is, um, this is actually why I decided to go check my target. I've been checking it lately at, since I got the snowflake cars. It hasn't been nothing but a whole bunch of like old stuff. But after race grooves, in between race grooves video, and then um, WWE 5155's Instagram uh, post of him finding these cases, this case at Target, I decided to go check out my target. Um, so it's pretty, it's it's a big thanks to them for pointing out. They got these at Target, otherwise I probably wouldn't have found these. But, um, in Race Crew's video, he pointed out that his... I don't remember which one it was, but, like, the blister is cracked. Here, let me... Let me pick up my phone to show you guys this. He was pointing out... Hold on, it's gonna get dark for a second. He was pointing out that his blister was cracked, and on here... I'll, I'll hold it like this. Right there. There, you can see it, kind of see it there. There's, uh, you now I'll go on the inside. Right there, there's a crack there. Oh, there's a crack there. Then, on the bottom here. Oh, hold on, let me grab it. And so we, so we pulled the, that cardboard all the way. On the bottom here, there's another crack. Right there. So there's like, this whole corner is cracked. I don't know what's with Monster Jam. I mean, I believe his was cracked over on this side, uh, Race Groups was, but I don't know what's with Mattel and Mo with the Monster Jam trucks lately. Um, with, well, I'm going to put it down for a second, but you guys can still hear me. I don't know what's with them, with why they're having to put this tape on the blisters and stuff, and then why all their stuff's coming cracked. Um, he had a 124th scale truck, I believe, too, that he found that had a big cracked corner. I don't know what's with Mattel and Mos with their Monster Jam line, just almost not treating it. I don't want to make it sound like that, but they're almost like not treating it like they should be. But, I don't know. But alright, let's look at the El Toro Loco quick. So here's El Toro Loco. It's a black truck. It has white stuff on both the tires over here. I think, like I said, I think it's just from it being stuck on the thing. But, um, it has... The orange body, it's X-ray, it's plastic, it's a little, little flexible, not much. Has the horns on top. And the jump it came with, this is like a steel or metal one too. And it's a bright green. I like it. Um, so I got three of the, st uh, what, three of the ramps that it comes out with. Here, I'll try to show you guys. There's that yellow one right there, and I know it's sideways, but... There's the other one. It looks like it's a dirt ramp with a car on the end of it. Um, that's the only one I didn't get. I believe that's the same one that comes with um, Avenger. 
But I just didn't get Avenger because I have at least 10 Avengers in between the regular versions and the World Finals versions. I, I just didn't think I needed, needed another Avenger. So I didn't get it, but... So these are the three I got from there. So I got these three. El Toro Loco. Let me move these to the back. El Toro Loco. Son of a Digger and Monster Mutt. Those are the three I got today from Target. Then, one second. Um, let me grab my trucks. Um, right here, these are my Battle Slammer trucks I have down here un under my filming area. Let me find the other truck I need. Probably gonna be on the very bottom of the bag. I have all of them in. There it is. This is technically a 2016 truck too, because it came out in 2016. But I'm sure by now you know what guys. What you, I know. I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. That's right. I have the. 2015 slash 16 crush car Walmart edition. There's the crush car. Um, Doomsday. Um, I never found Doomsday. Um, I never found it with the Battle Slammer, which not a big deal. I really don't care for the Battle Slammers, but I never found it with the Battle Slammer. Um. Believe it or not, this was my first truck I bought in 2016. I bought it on the 1st of January. Now, I have the, still have the thing here and the cardboard that came, was in there. But, um, I bought this one. Of course, it's just regular black Doomsday black room. It has a blue, like, full-size full four-door crush car. Um, this was the first truck I bought of 2016. I went to Walmart. I was getting some stuff, and this was... I think it was the first or second time I went, but, um, I went to Walmart, and I was at, look, I, every, like, pretty much every time I go to Walmart, I look at toys. I happened to go back, look at toys. This guy was, had a push cart, like, they put TVs on, and it was, had cases of toys. Um, I noticed there was at least four or five cases that said 164 scale Monster Jam, and then it had, I think it said value, added value or something like that. But, so I found that. And there was like at least four cases and it had the 12 pieces. So I knew they were Monster Jam. And I was looking because just a couple weeks ago, like just like two weeks, not even two weeks. They filled the pegs with the Monster Jam. Um, let's see, it was the Big Kahuna and the King Crunch case. And then when I was, and then over Christmas, like right before, right after Christmas, they stocked the pegs again with the, um, Metal Militia, Bony Hunter, um, Exterminator, and, do it was Exterminator, Bony Hunter, Doomsday, Black Backdraft, and one more, I can't think of it, but there was five, I think there was five trucks in there that I wanted. I only found Metal Militia and stuff. Doomsday wasn't there. I didn't get Doomsday, but um, I did get get Metal Militia and stuff. Then Doomsday, um, I was just like, oh well, hopefully I'll find it soon. And then that was right about the time that I started seeing pictures show up on Instagram of the 2000. Well, the, nobody was sure if they were 2016 or if they were they were regular or just Walmart exclusive trucks. But I started seeing pictures on Instagram show up. With people finding this, and it was Doomsday was in the case, so I'm like, and then when I noticed those cases at Walmart, I'm like, okay, so these are. I was thinking to myself, I'm like, okay, these are either gonna be the crush car cases, or they're I was they were gonna be the cases that I was looking for that had um, backdraft and stuff in it. So I was thinking about it and decided, all right, I'm gonna go ask the guy if I can, because the pegs were kind of empty, so I'm, I was gonna ask him. I asked him like. Can I, I notice the pegs are kind of empty, and so I'm like, can I p put up some of these Monster Jam trucks for you? And he's like, well, no, they're not going over there. And at first, the way he said it, it sounded like they were just, it was a midway point that they accidentally brought them out. They were going to a different Walmart. But then he's like, but if you're looking to buy one, I can open them for you, and you can get one. So he opened them for me. 
Um, he opened, there was, he, there was two cases, there was two different stacks of two cases, and there was like one in the back of the cart, but he, there was one case already cracked, and then he cracked the three cases, um, that were up front, and the one case that was already cracked, it didn't look like anything was missing from it, but then he cracked the three fresh right in front of me, I found like, I think it was two doomsdays in each one, so I picked up a doomsday. Um, I almost didn't because he was having troubles with it, um, when he was scanning the barcode on the bottom, it kept, like, nothing would come up, it was like saying it wasn't a barcode in the system, so he was like, he told me, well, if you want one, I'll just print a label for you, which was he, that's what he had time to do, right there, there's the label on it, but he ended up printing, he's like, I can print a label for you and you can still get it, but I just told him, like, no, it's not worth it, um, it, it's because he didn't couldn't find his label printer. I'm like, no, it's, um, it's fine because you can't find your printer. I'll just come back. I'll keep checking to see when they get pegged. He's like, oh no, it, and he's like, okay, well, then I went back and I ended up getting. He ended up going and getting a printer and found found one and printed off the label for me. And then like two days later, when they were finally pegged, I noticed they had label these labels on all of them. So I don't think they could get them into the system, so they just printed off these labels. But we had those, um, that we sat on those cases of trucks for quite a while now. Now we're finally down to maybe one case of them, so I'm hoping soon we'll get, um, some new cases in. I'm hoping maybe we'll skip right over A case of the jumps and go to B case, because I don't know, you guys have Instagram and you don't follow them, go check out. I know one person, the only one I can remember is WWE5155. If you haven't looked at his Instagram, like if you're not following him, go look at it. He has a picture of B Case on the, on there. Um, so I'm hoping, because of all the trucks in there, I'm really hoping that maybe we'll skip right over A Case at my Walmart. Because, like, really, we only get like two to th three Monster Jam cases a year. But I'm hoping they'll just skip it. And go to B because B has Titan, um, Zombie Zombie Hunter, Soldier Fortune, and um, Color Treads Zomb or Color Treads Dragon, which is just like the Son of a Digger, but it's Dragon. It has bright orange tires. Those are the four that I want out of that case. And then there's like a X-ray Prowler. And a couple other trucks that I really don't care about. But I really want those four. I'm hoping we'll get that case. But alright. this These are my finds of Monster Jam so far in 2016. Um, I guess thanks for watching. If you like what you just watched. Make sure you subscribe. Leave a comment down below. Like. And uh, stay tuned for more videos.